So, either they uncovered something that came alive and killed them, or worse, mimicked them. Yes, I've been watching too many old sci-fi movies. Okay. I have a feeling we're going to be making use of these sort of tunnel entrances, don't they? Okay. Anyone else getting a bad feeling? Okay. Scanners? Going a bit... Okay. I think... Oh! What? I am. Why, though? I put my barrier up. Okay. You know what? It should have done this from the start. Get me... Some singularity and stuff going on. Do they have shields? Yes, they do. Nice! Oh, that is so nice! S they're still alive, though. Oh, God. Right. Uh, okay. What? Where is my... Where is my... That one, I want that on. I'll keep ready. Okay, right. So, lift, also sabotage. How are we doing for health and uh, shields? Liara, you've used your barrier. You've used your barrier. Okay, okay. Oh! What the? That! I'm gonna. No, that's not what I wanted. I want. I'm gonna throw on him, and then I'm absolutely gonna be needing my barrier again. So, don't be near those things when they explode. Right. This was like that. The team must have unearthed some alien technology that turned them into mindless fanatics. Whatever they found, it is long gone now. But this is the same thing that the Geth were using on Eden Prime. Isn't it? This very much looks like what they were using on Eden Prime. And... Okay. Oh! Assault Rifle, Phoenix 5, and Ursus 4. Nice. Okay. Keep your eyes open. Not 100% sure we're out of the water yet. You really probably should stick with pistol. You're a little bit better with the pistol, I think. All right. I have a feeling that's what they unearthed. All right, there was one of the container. Okay. Yeah, let's check that out when we've done the complete sweep. Does that look vaguely Reaper technology to you. I mean, I, I'm getting that feeling, and, and the husks were definitely something the Geth were using, so... Okay. Alright. 
that's the entire place by the looks of things. Fusion containment cell. What? You lead, I'll follow. All right, does anybody know? Oh, oh, what? I'm stuck. Does anyone know what we should do with this? Okay. Can we get in there? Yeah, it answer. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you can actually. Strangely enough. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, right. They're right on top of... Oh, God. They're all around us. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Everyone, get back. I'm probably going to need to get my barrier back. Don't let them explode on you. Just... Right, let's keep them away from everyone. Keep them away. And... Is there another one next to us? Yes, there is. Okay. Oh, no, not good. Not good. All right. We've lost Liara for now. Okay. You know what? Got him! Oh, whoa, 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 there's a lot of them. That accounts for all the Exogeny survey team. They were converted to cybernetic husks by devices similar to those used by the Geth on Eden Prime. How they came to be buried on a frontier world so far from Geth territory is a mystery. Yeah. Way that very nearly went quite badly. Can we take this? Should we take this? Ah, so there were multiple. There were multiple rooms filled with them. There are the spikes. But who put them on the spikes? I I have a feeling we may have had a geth incursion here. Okay, not not. This is Oh no. Oh, wrong way. Oh for f We're not using Omnigel to get in there. Okay, right, better job this time. So, we got some reasonably decent loot there, actually. Let's take a quick look, starting with the armor. Phoenix Fight, that's... It's better tech biotic by orders of magnitude, but better all round, let's... Yeah, I'm not, but still way better. I also really feel like I need another first aid um, mod for Liara. I, I'm, I'm thinking that's part of the problem here. Let's have a look at this. Is that better? That's slightly better shields. Just not as good tech biotic protection. Mm, honestly, I'm... I'm Where's it? Where's it? Where's the other? Right, there you go. Uh, oof. I think we're just going to leave leave it with that one. And I don't think we've got any new armor for Tally. Wow, got, got some nice pistols, actually. The Stinger is better all round. Oh, well, it's, it's the same accuracy as the Stinger 2. Uh, but it's an upgrade on the heat sink and the damage. But the Stiletto, 
way better on the heatsink. Not quite as accurate, but a lot more damage. And then the... What was... Where was... Yeah, the Kessler? No. The Raikou! That's a huge amount more damage as well, but... Actually, more accurate. More accurate than the Stiletto, but nowhere near as good heatsink. I gotta be honest. That seems to be a bit of a no-brainer. That's a good pistol now. That really is. Okay. Nothing of an improvement there. Two sniper rifles. Slightly better than the one I've got. Neither of you two use it, so for now I'll... Biotic amp. Meh. No grenade mods. Assault rifle. These... Whoa! Haliat Armory. Seems to be a good... Um, gotta save that for Garrus or Rex, I guess. You guys are not... Actually, to be honest with you... Accuracy? That's a good one. That's less... That's less accuracy, so... As is that. I'm thinking this for Garrus? Yeah, that's a definite upgrade for Tally, absolutely, and Liara's probably going to be using pistol more than anything, but overall she's not very good with any of the weapons, so... Oh, the weapon she's got right now is kind of crap. That's... You know what? Let's go with that one, then. Let's go with that one. It's <laughs> It's got twice as good heat sink. it's more accurate, and it's a lot more damage, so, you know, when she... She does have to... Anti-personnel. Oh, no, I want... I definitely want the anti-personnel round for myself. What else have we got? Recall damper? I don't think she needs that. Um, I've got armor piercing on my pistol and on the shotgun. I think the husks are probably organic. They're probably better off with the... Uh, Anti-personnel ammo, but that are none left. Yeah, not loving this armor, but I'm loving the protection it gives me. The question now is, were the Geth or whatever technology it was that converted them lying in wait buried deep down here, or did the Geth arrive and... Rally round. Guys, okay, coming. How are we doing for health? Liara's got my first aid module at the moment. She uh, she needs it more than I do, and we're actually a little low on med gel. So yeah, I mean, did the Geth come here and take the survey team? In which case, they came here to get something, probably. But if the survey team uncovered something, it means we could be having this sort of a problem pop up all over the place. Right. We've got one more anomaly and a bit of debris. Let's go and check those out before we get out of here. Looks like this debris is on the other side of the mountain, so we're doing a little bit of rally quo cross. And apparently sensors are picking up hostile Activity. Is that it? I guess we're going to find out any second now, but I have got the horrible feeling. Oh no, it's up there. Let's tell you what, let's go round. The scanner isn't showing it as large enough to be a fresher more, but. Stay down. Cover me. All targets eliminated. Yeah. That was stupid, gentlemen. I was in a armored vehicle with a big gun. All right. Let's have a look. Okay. Manual bypass. Oh, yeah. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do this. 
Oh. You can do this. You can do this. You can definitely do this. Uh, ah! <sighs> Tungsten rounds, incendiary rounds, and fusion explosive. Okay. Oh, and we got some some other stuff as well. Of course we did. Right. Did we get any better pistols all of a sudden? No. Um, shotguns. Another scimitar. Right. We got an upgrade for the grenades, didn't we? Fusion Explosive 1 is what we've currently got. But we've got Fusion Explosive 4. Don't mind if I do. And we also got did we get some more armor plating shield? No, no, no. It was it was it was definitely ammo. Uh it, we had incendiary rounds. Less accurate, but it burns. Tungsten! This does a lot of damage versus synthetics. Way better than armor piercing. Like it. Alright, so against synthetics, I want this. Against Flesh targets, we almost certainly want that. 10 damage per second. Although, with a shotgun, might want this. Really? Overall? Just at the moment, I'm more worried about Geth. Okay, that's the debris. Let's go and investigate the anomaly to the north. Is yet another trip over the mountains? Whoa! Okay. Should be somewhere straight up here. Or well, not. Am I on the wrong side of the mountain? No. Well, yes, just that particular mountain. Alright. Let's see what's over there. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, we're, we're, we're definitely going off-road, so to speak. Not that there are any roads here. Alright. I mean, this does not look like it's territory for a thresher more. So we should be... Is this just a bunch of downed probes that we can... Transmitter tower. Deactivate. This device is transmitting tight beam signals into the geosynchronous orbit. This disrupts the survey team's GPS satellites, causing them to crash nearby. Oh, okay. So there'll be no more crashing then, yeah? Uh, which is a good thing. Which is very much a good thing, but can I not? Is there nothing in these? No. All right then. Yes, little disappointed. I mean, it, it's good. We've we've done an important task. We've done an important service for this planet. We'll admit, was kind of hoping we'd be able to loot something from the satellite too. Because we need, we need, we need all the help we can get. Better armor, better mods, better weapons. We need credits. Mostly so we can buy better armor, better weapons. Okay, so that's the survey team found. I think is the best way to describe that. I mean, we got some useful information, some worrying information. Let's just finish checking all of the planets around here. Vermel is an enormous terrestrial world of mixed rock and ice with an atmosphere of methane and ethane. Its frozen surface is mainly composed of calcium with deposits of iron. Because of noxious surface gases, explorers are warned to... Honidor is a moderately sized ice world with an extremely thin atmosphere composed of krypton and xenon. Its frozen surface is unusually smooth, suggesting widespread repaving by cryovolcanic processes, though no such activity is currently evident. Okay, right, so that's that system. We still have Farinata, where we know there is some sort of hostage situation going on. I believe it was on an abandoned freighter. 
I'm going to guess that's it. All right, well, we've got some other planets to check out afterwards. Right, biotics. Yeah, the Ontario is a Kowloon class modular conveyor of human design configured for mixed freight and passenger hauling. It is making a hard burn for the cover of an asteroid cluster. Okay. So, I definitely want to take Liara. She is our biotic. And I do want someone with decryption, but I'm thinking someone with slightly more, um, oomph is now required. All right. So, I think we need to play this one very, very carefully. Also, I may have a new weapon for you, Garrus. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, yeah, that's a big imp- Whoa! Yeah, no, that's- that's it. Okay, so we're going up against Biotics. Incendiary rounds. Ooh, it's not a terrible idea, but I think I'm going to leave those for myself. I think toxic damage. You know what? <sighs> kind of a horrible way to go, but there there you have it. And you've got anti-personnel round... No. Yes, anti-personnel rounds there. Do we have a better shot at sniper rifle for you? No. Light armor. Survivor. No, definitely not. Okay. Oh, and... Yeah. Turian agent. Increased damage with assault rifles by 4%. Assault training. Adrenaline burst. Could be nice. Although, I'm also thinking advanced overkill. Advanced assassination. I'm thinking we get you the advanced shield boost, but that actually could be... Yeah, you know what? Let's unlock... Let's unlock that for you, shall we? Oh, I was supposed to be unlocking electronics with you. <sighs> yes, I was going to unlock electronics with you. That was foolish. All right, well, the only thing is, is this could be a combat. Well, this is definitely going to be a combat mission. Okay. Oh, Liara's got my first aid. All right. Let's, let's get this set up. Um, I'm going to put... I'm going to put Garrus. You go there. Liara, you go here. All right. So. Are we going to be able to talk... Are we going to be able to talk these people down? Possibly not. Uh. Right, this is... very... Intruders, kill the hostage. Wait, what? What? Yes, on it. All right. Okay, okay. destroy you. Yeah, that's more than possible. Uh, can, can you? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot to change to. Oh, you, you know. I'm getting absolutely pummeled here. Let's get that shield back up and then. You must die. Right. Time 
to get a bit of, uh, okay, what was that? That was the overload, right, you know, you know. Yes, I'm looking out. Holy me. Right. That's not good. I'm going with that. I need you to just hit them with everything you can. You got your sniper rifle. Okay. Ah, no. No. Okay, incendiary rounds on the pistol and the um, anti-personnel rounds on my shotgun. Right. Oh. Electronics. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Right, you have got... Oh. Actually, you know what? I don't know what, how we want to do... I do not know how we want to do this. I think I want you there, and... I'm wondering... I'm thinking, like, maybe you here a little bit... No. I want you here so you can get some sort of sight... Can you take some cover? So you can get some sight on there. I want you to switch to that. All right, I'm gonna go and grab their attention. We're, we're gonna have to do this quickly, but I don't wanna be stuck in what is a fairly obvious ambush. All right. Okay. Oh, well, what are you? What are you good? Where was that? Gaddis? Gaddis? What are you? Gaddis? Come to me. You're there. You're there. And right. I want. Strip. Strip the um shields. And then do a singularity. Nice. Okay. There's still way more of them. Okay. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do. That is... No, not that either. That is not what I wanted to do. I wanted that. And that... Barriers. Barriers holding. Barrier is holding. Okay, now we can move. Now we can move. Right. Got him. Okay. Are we... Is... Okay, what? See how it is? You write letters and everyone ignores you. Force is the only thing people appreciate. So how about if I kill Chairman Burns and finish the charade? Please. I was trying to help you people. Ch uh... Yeah, you want to calm... That, take them down. Uh... Let's try and save the hostage. Let's not do anything we're all going to regret. Why not? What have we got to lose? Since the chairman here decided that we didn't get reparations, we've got nothing left to live for. But I've changed my mind. Seeing you all, it, it, it's clear that you all deserve... You had your chance. Some L2s are nearly crippled from side effects of the implants, but you voted against reparations. <sighs> yeah. You're gonna die here if you do that. You pull that trigger, we are going to kill you. I'm not even saying you don't have a beef with these guys that's somewhat valid. I've heard what happened. Well, you're gonna die if you pull that trigger. If you die fighting, you'll get a lot of biotics killed as well. What do you mean? If people think that all L2 biotics are violent extremists, what is that going to accomplish? But people need to hear about what the government has done and what it has failed to do. People have already heard. You don't have to kill me to make your point. You're right. I don't want to die. Maybe something will happen this time. We surrender. Thank you, Commander. 
I thought I was dead when they took me. I'll see to it that the reparations discussion is reopened. I didn't know they were so desperate. No, you didn't. Not a problem. I'm not 100% sure here, but... Then you weren't doing your job. The Fifth Fleet Cruiser will pick you and the prisoners up. Yeah. Thank you, Commander. I thought I was dead when they took me. Right, well, while you guys are waiting for the pickup, we're gonna make sure there's no uh, contraband and dangerous devices left behind. Equalizer 4. That's another Haliat Armory one. That is a major upgrade as well. There you go. New sniper rifle for you. And did I forget to give you the new... No, I didn't. There you go. You've got the Thunder 4 assault rifle. Nice. Do we have... Yeah, we got... We've got quite a few options on the ammo. For Liara... I think we got... We got another stiletto, but... Who else could I be saving that for? Tally. Maybe. Maybe Tally. It's going to depend who I bring. All right, you know what? We'll, we'll give you the stiletto. What was the stinger like? The stinger was actually good accuracy. Did we get any armor for you? No, we didn't. Right. And for me... New shotgun, Haliat Armory. Better accuracy. He thinks lower, but more damage. That's... That's rather nice. And pistol, I've already got the stiletto, so no change there. Right. And what about the grenade launcher? Fusion explosive for... No. Got, got that already. All right. Well, we got, you know... We got the hostage situation sorted with as little bloodshed as possible. Basically, two of the hostage takers are still alive, but so is the, um, what was he called? The director of the place? So hopefully he'll get something done to help those people out. Do feel a little bit sorry for them. Yeah. Okay, well... Message coming in. Patching it through. Thank you for dealing with the hostage situation, Commander. Chairman Burns was quite impressed by the way you resolved the situation peacefully. Your assistance above and beyond the formal duties has been noted, Commander. Fifth Fleet out. Okay. Well, that's good, I suppose. Let's just check all of these planets before we head back to the Citadel. And... Okay. Tunshagon is a hydrogen-helium gas giant with traces of chlorine and nitrogen in its atmosphere. It has an unusually small number of moons. Right. Time to head back to the Citadel and speak to the Admiral and give him the bad news about his missing men. Might call in the requisitions officer in CSEC whilst we're here. See what we can afford now. I'm pretty sure the top items are still well out of reach, but maybe some other items. May also call in the um the docks. Restock on Medgel. I can't remember what that um first aid mod, the really good one, cost. Can we afford that now? We might be able to, actually. Oh, I could have refilled my med gel here. You know what? It doesn't matter. Who to take? Well, okay, we've got to take Garrus. <sighs> you know what? I I'm not expecting to get into a fight, but honestly, Rex is probably feeling a bit stir-crazy at the moment. He's been locked in the hold for a while. Might be a good idea to take him out for a walk. That does sound Equalizing bad. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. And I'd be the same. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. 
Exo Presley has the deck. Exo Presley. Yeah, I'd be the same if I was stuck down in. Oh, the Rear Admiral. Rear Admiral Mihailovic, Fifth Fleet. Uh, look. Commander Shepard, SSV Normandy. You don't know who I am, do you, Commander? I command the 63rd Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. And the Council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. Uh, I don't like it either. Okay, look, I'm not that keen on the Council. They are easy to dislike. It's, it's true, but this is, I mean, it's my ship. It's, we've got a human specter. It's, Captain Anderson made it clear to me that my assignment came from way up in the brass. They say jump, I say how high. Remember that when I tell you to jump. I don't begrudge the politician's decision to throw you to the council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. D Are you... My ship? An over-designed piece of tin? This ship saved our lives a dozen times over. An exaggeration. I've read your reports. No, it's not. This experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills. For the same price, we could have had a heavy cruiser. But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. Uh, on... I mean, look, I know you're a rear admiral, but I do not believe I answer to you. I'm actually a spectre now, which means I only answer to the council. And this, I'm sorry, we're on a classified mission. Normandy is an Alliance warship, but she's on loan to the Citadel. That means she's not in your chain of command. I believe there's something wrong with my ears. Did you just contradict me? Uh, uh, uh yes, I believe I did. Normandy is not legally part of the Alliance military. I can't allow you aboard without permission from the Office of Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. Sophistry. You're talking like the Council, using the law to obstruct the Alliance. Have it your way, Commander. But expect me to file a report on this. Okay, I do not wish to speak ill of a superior officer, so I'm not in Going entertainment news, Francis Kitt has announced plans to direct Hamlet with Elcor cast members. The this is not news, you've told us this before. To the with a Hamlet who uses Elcor body language and pheromones. Oh, I suppose this is what they do. 24 hour news, you just repeat, a human repeat them over the and over. Judge Hamlet by his deeds and not his oh, well that was a good start, wasn't it? Arrive, upset a rear admiral. Let's see what else could go wrong. Commander Shepard? Yeah? Kalisa been seen in Aljilani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? Um... What sort of questions? People back home have heard a lot of wild stories about you, Commander. I can give you the chance to set the record straight. What do you say? I <laughs> Uh... So long as you understand that I may not be able to answer all questions. I'm sure our viewers will understand. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human spectre? <laughs> not very diplomatic. Uh... The spectres represent the best of every species in the galaxy. To be asked to join them is an honor. Some have said your appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? Uh... I think they know not to ask me to work against my own people. I think our viewers will be glad to hear that, Commander. You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? She's not just... <laughs> It's a great human innovation. There, uh, yes. I mean, we had help, but you know. The Normandy is a triumph of human engineering. 
Like our development of fighter carriers, it shows other races that we're able to think outside the box. That's gratifying. Many defeatist officers claim that the Alliance can't compete with the naval power of, say, the Turians. Uh... Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? Well, no, 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 no. I may work for the Citadel, but the Normandy is, is an Alliance ship, and I command it. Miss Algelani, I wear the Alliance uniform. And if you think anyone other than me says where the Normandy can go, you're sadly mistaken. No offense intended, Commander. I'm sure you have to follow the orders of your superiors. Of course, now your superiors are aliens. Okay. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? Uh, there is no possible way of saying no to that. He was behind... That's... No, I'm definitely not going to be that. No. That pretty much confirms what she says. That also confirms that... I'm afraid I can't comment on whatever my current assignment may or may not be. Don't worry. We'll find out. The eyes of Earth are on you. Don't let us down. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard. You're welcome. Why do I feel like I've just stepped through a bloody minefield? <laughs>